my god. Oh, it's a little black kitten. If you guys like couples gaming channels, then click the link down below. We play Sims over there too, and we would love to see you there. Hey guys, it's Fantasia and welcome to another episode of the Foster Home Challenge. So I'm recording this back to back from the last part, but they're probably not going up the same day. So if you did tell me, if you guys told me anything that I'm not talking about in this episode, like in the comments on the last one, that's just because I'm recording them back to back. So if you guys like left any suggestions that I'm like not mentioning and things like that, that is why. <laughs> so don't worry, when I record the next one, I would have seen the comments from the previous episode by then. So we are, he's, he's awake first again. He's always awake first. I don't know. He's just awake first every day. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and wake up Axel uh, and he's going to make some food. So we're going to serve some breakfast. We're going to make, we're going to make some pancakes today because why not? So you guys, we need to just keep working, working, working our way. We're going to try to have them go out today. We're going to try to squeeze in everything today. I don't know if we can do it. Maybe it'd be more suitable to do that Saturday, but I really wanted to have them go out today. So we're probably going to do that. Um, we're going to do the best we can. I don't know. Maybe they can work in the daytime on stuff. And then as soon as they get back home from school, they can head out. I still really want to get London adopted. We got to do that seriously. Um, it needs to happen. <laughs> it needs to happen for him. Like it's so important. I just think he, he needs his forever home. So we're going to try. We're going to try our best. Um, I think I'm going to wake you up, to be honest, and have you take a shower and she can enjoy some pancakes. Oh, that's lovely. <laughs> she can enjoy some pancakes afterwards. What, what is he doing? Oh, chatting with his dad. That's so cute. Oh, the toddler is cranky. Ooh, is she going to go eat some peas? Because that's perfect. I mean, you do your thing, girl. You get yourself some peas. All right. You grab yourself some pancakes. You grab yourself some pancakes. Same with you. You're not really that hungry, but just grab them anyways. I think pancakes would be a lot more appetizing for you, girl. But if you want your peas, you have your peas. <laughs> Why do I feel the need to say it like that? I have no idea. But he, she's going to go enjoy those. Then she needs a bath today. Uh, and then how are... Are you still sleeping? Okay, you sleeping... Oh, super cute. Okay, you're, you're, you're just passed out. Oh, he's so cute. He has glasses when he sleeps. It's adorable. I don't even want to change it. It looks so cute cute. Um, <laughs> I may give him a little bit of a makeover, but he's so cute the way he is. Like, I'm going to keep his hair. It just suits him. Yeah, it's so cute. Um, you need to hurry. Come on, what you doing? He's just standing there. He's not eating. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to have you go ahead and... Oh, wait, didn't he? Oh, no, wait, he still didn't finish it. You still didn't finish your book. Why? How? When are you going to finish that? No idea. <laughs> She's showering for 3,000 years, but that's fine. Um, maybe she'll start the morning off with a painting. We always do a landscape because I don't know why it makes her the most. Uh, that happens to my sins a lot, though. Um, you need to go to school like I did. Hi, dude. Go to school. Um, get your booty to school. You're going to clean that up instead? <laughs> Foster family, let's go ahead and go to school now. He's cleaning though, so we'll let him do that. Okay, or not. Are you going? I hope you're going. I hope you're going, dude. Please go. He better disappear off this lot if he goes somewhere else. That's great. Okay, I think he's going. Okay, he's off to school. Perfect. Oh, wait, who is this? Are you who you think? No, you're not. I thought you were someone else. <laughs> So you're at school as well. You know what? Go make yourself some friends, dude. You go do that. Um, you're finished with that. What's wrong, beeps? Oh, you need a bath. Ooh, thinking level two. Awesome. So she's eating her pancakes. You need to hurry up and write your book and give this tot some attention. Well, you can talk to her while you write. I know what you can't play though. Let's go ahead and brighten her day. Let's go ahead and um, ask about her day, and then he's probably going to be the one to give her a bath in a little bit, uh, because I just feel like, I feel like Cora does a lot. Is that just me? <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like she does a lot. Michael has met Orange while at school. I've never heard that name before in The Sims. I know it's like a randomized name, but I've never heard it. Have you guys ever seen a Sim named Orange? I feel like I always see Sims names over and over and over again, but not that one. Not that one. 
All right, you need to go potty. That's actually perfect because she can go potty. And then, oh, he's being so cute with her. Are you still, is the tot still sleeping? Oh, you're awake. Oh, you need a bath. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna have, okay, we're gonna take turns. So she's gonna stop painting for a second. She's gonna give him a bath. And then Axel's gonna give her a bath. So, ooh, we made 104. Oh, see, this is good, you guys. This is helpful. It's almost New Year's Eve. That's exciting. I believe it's probably tomorrow. Yeah. Ooh, whoa. It's Ashlyn's birthday on New Year's Eve. It's Michael's and Axel's. What? <gasps> We're gonna have a pond say. Oh, see, it'll be perfect to go out on Saturday. You know what? We'll try to go out in this part too, maybe to like a, something basic like the park. Um. But yeah, that's gonna be exciting. Okay, you gonna like stop that and like, you know, give him a bath? Yeah. Alright, so he has finished a book. Yes, it's not gonna make much like at all, but you know what? It's something. Uh, he's gonna gain fame. You know what? I don't see this family gaining fame. Do you, do you see that at all? Cause I don't. I am going to actually opt them out of that. So if you guys don't know, if you don't want your Sims to like be getting famous from everything, just do this. Um, Sims begin opted out of fame. Um, so there we go. <laughs> Does that mean they're just not going to get fame like from anything? Will the like theme of Bob go away? I don't know. Um, hopefully. Cause yeah. Ooh. Oh yes. Yes. Send them over. Okay. We have another potential. Oh, maybe it's his day. I don't know because he's home and like the teenager's not. Maybe it will be. I mean, there's nothing wrong with him getting adopted first. And then we can just try to get London adopted as soon as possible too. I might try. I really might try. Um, because like, why not? Um, is he so dirty though? Because like, give him a bath, dude. You can't just get him adopted all dirty. Like, hi. I don't know why it's like so difficult just to give him a bath. Oh my god, you, you guys, it just said Michael has met Jalissa while at school. And like, you live here. Okay, so let's see if we can actually interact with you. Because I don't know why that was happening last time, but let's see. Um, Let's go ahead and ask about living situation. And let's see if she'll, he'll actually go up to her and like it'll complete. Um, fingers crossed. Okay, so it worked now. So he lives with Malcolm. He? She? What am I saying? <laughs> um, I mean, that's normal. That's normal. Um, there, it looks like, you know, she's getting older. Maybe she wants... See, then wouldn't she want a teenager? You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know. I feel like she would. But then she's gonna end up leaving. I don't know. Maybe it's like... Is it meant to be? Are they meant to have a toddler? It just happens to be that they keep coming over when he, the teenager's not home. You know what? We're going to introduce. All right, you guys, I think we're going to do it. We're going to do it. We're just going to do it. It's, I don't know, like, it just seems like she's coming over here to meet him. I don't know why, but we're, we're he, she, I think she's going to take Raphael. Oh, and you know what? Maybe it's a good thing because every single, hey, look who's here. The star. <laughs> Every single time we, she's actually pretty cute. <laughs> um, every time we adopt, look how she walks. We adopt someone. It takes a very long time, or not adopt someone, foster someone. It takes a very long time for us to get them adopted. And this time was pretty quick. And you know, maybe sometimes, you know, he, he found his home quite quickly. Moved out foster family member. Oh, so wait, did it actually work correctly? Former foster family. Oh, Oh, where is he? Because he should still be in the house, right? Or maybe the toddlers just vanish? Oh, possibly. Maybe. I don't know. We'll just let her chill here for a bit, I guess. We're not going to, like, kick her out. We need to wash the bathtub. Oh, my God. Don't look at my dirty bathtub. And then resume your landscape painting. You kind of need to take a shower, but why do you always want to play with this thing? I mean, it gives them fun, but you better not get eaten. Oh, my God. It doesn't really, what is this? Okay. It doesn't really give him, give him fine. And like, I don't like it. <laughs> it's scary. All right. Uh, well, you know, he got some more fun, I guess. Okay. So I guess it does give him fun. All right, you guys, the family's feeling pretty good. Um, London and Michael are home from school. So I think I'm going to head them uh, or have them head out. Mm, I mean, we did say the park would be good because, you know, then everyone has something to do. Maybe that'll be good. But then, uh, 
I mean, maybe they want to go explore somewhere else, perhaps. Um, Delso Valley, eh, I really don't see them going there, honestly. Um, let's see. Maybe we can head to, where's, what's some places in Willow Creek? I mean, the park here looks really cool now. Maybe we'll go here. Yeah, I really like the way this has been redone in Plumbella Save. Let's go there. Okay, so they are at the park now and they're gonna have some fun. They gotta have some fun for once. It's just, it's mandatory. <laughs> Although it's snowing here. You know what? Who cares? It's fine. The snow is beautiful. They're just gonna enjoy it. They're gonna have a fun time and just swing, you know? Um, ask to swing with. Let's swing. Oh, let's swing with Ratna. Yeah, go do that. That's adorable. Um, and then you come on the slide. Oh, okay. And then for the adults, they can kind of, well, like, they could hang out over here and like watch the kids or, um, well, see, she's going to go on the slide for right now. Um, see, he's happy from the snow. That's so cute. I'm going to have him cook something. Let's grill like something that'll make them warm from the cold winter snow. Let's do baked potatoes. So is she, he's going to go ahead and make that. She's feeling confident. Um, what else is there to do here? Ooh, I love this, you guys. And the pets can come here too. <gasps> Look! Oh my god. Oh, it's a little black kitten. I love black kittens. I just think they're so cute. Look at it hopping in the snow. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> that's so cute. I love little black kittens. Like, I don't know why, but they're the cutest thing ever. And it's so sad because I feel like it, okay, is it like this where you guys are? Let me know. If you go and like visit the shelter sometimes um, around you, your animal shelter, is there always so many black kittens? Because that's how it is here. And I know a lot of people don't want to adopt black cats because of like the superstition and stuff like that. But like, it makes me so sad. Like, because our shelter doesn't really get that many like baby animals. Usually it's like grown uh, cats, dogs, and usually they literally have like one or two dogs. They barely have any dogs around here uh, at the shelter by us. Um, but yeah, um, there's like way more big cats and stuff. Um, but then every single time there's a kitten, all the time it's a black one. One of them I adopted, which was Toby. And then recently when I went, uh, I just like, I, even if I can't adopt at the time, I love giving them love and just like, cause you, you're able to go in and like pet them and like take them out and play with them and just you know, snuggle them and stuff. And I love doing that. <laughs> um, cause like you can tell they like, they're just so happy for the attention. So I love doing that and they're so snuggly. Um, so yeah, there, there was a black kitten again. And then the last time I went there was too. And it's just like, why? <laughs> they're always black kittens. Like they're so sweet. Aw, but she's having fun on the slide. She's actually pretty tired. Um, hopefully she's good. Oh, I want to get a picture of her because it's actually really cute in the snow. I actually like her outerwear. It's cute. Oh, okay. This is a good picture. Okay. So she's having fun. Even though she's so tired, we're going to have to leave soon. I just wanted them to get out, you know, and kind of like have some time. Um, I mean, good thing that, you know what? I was going to have her go in the pool, but like, I'm just like waiting for my, to kill my Sim, huh? Like, let's just have her go in the pool with the snow. I think that honestly is just a habit of me still being used to no weather, even though we've had um, seasons for a while now, I feel like for the longest time we were able to just have our Sims do whatever. So like go in the pool whenever, you know? So then like, it's like, you gotta be like, oh yeah, there's snow on the ground and it's not just fake. It's real. They're going to freeze. <laughs> Cause like, then like I'd be used to just having the snow mod. And like, even though I know there's snow and I know it's cold, it's just like a natural thing because for so many years, we could just have them do whatever. It's like when you put a TV outside, you have like a pretty backyard for your Sims and you put a TV outside and you're like, oh yeah, it's gonna rain and the TVs are gonna break. <laughs> so yeah, or like a stereo and then the stereo breaks. I feel like the stereo is the most common one because it's normal to have a stereo outside. Then it rains and your stereo is fried. So that's happened to me a couple times. I don't think, I haven't had it happen with a TV. Yeah, I haven't done that. The only thing I've done is have Sims swim in the cold by accident and get a stereo outside in the rain. That's what I think those are the only two things I've done. Um, so yeah, flop. Oh, <laughs> you guys moved out foster family member. She's sad about it. 
Oh, she's gonna go eat her potato and then they're gonna head home soon just because little Missy's tired. And look, Marcella. Oh, uh, and look, Ratna. I love that she came like right after. Um, let's talk with her. Let oh, 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 <laughs> Ratna's so cute. Let's uh, discuss food flavors. Um, and then, what are, oh, what are you doing? You're so cute. You're shoveling the snow. You don't really need to do that at the park. It's not necessary. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, almost their birthday. Who's excited? I'm excited. Okay. I don't know where she's going, but let's um, interact with Marcella a little bit. And then, how are you doing? He's sleepy probably gonna get cold soon so she need oh she needs to head home soon she really does so we're gonna do that look how pretty the snow is though like wow this looks so peaceful and pretty Ooh, i love snow like this the falls like this it's so nice all right i love the way the tables look with the snow oh she's getting upset we gotta go home she's like i've had enough i'm done <laughs> we're gonna go home okay well they had their outing definitely when you have toddlers the outing has the outings have to be a little bit shorter but we got out and i think they're gonna get out again tomorrow so that's perfect all right so the family is home and they had a pretty good time out even if i mean it's 8 p.m it wasn't like necessarily cut short i mean time goes fast in the sim so you know um so oh we have a dirty plate up here but um they do have a nightlight now so that's perfect oh we can't even clean it okay you know what clean that up and then go to bed so he's gonna get some sleep um so tomorrow is saturday so they don't even have to worry about homework you're literally pooped go to bed you are also pooped, but not as pooped. So you're going to take advantage of that and do some painting. I would have her make a video, but the painting is a little bit faster. So, ooh, almost Ashlyn's birthday. I'm excited. Um, okay, you're asleep. I didn't even know. <laughs> and that's the only toddler we have right now. You know what? That might make things a little bit easier for the time being because I feel like once we... Okay, we're going to try not to adopt too many toddlers. Um, we'll adopt like the kids and teens and stuff, but not too many toddlers just for right now because I think it's going to be better until they're in the other house because then they'll act... The toddlers will have their own space. You know, right now, this situation is like really wonky. <laughs> so once they actually uh, have their own just everything like their own potty area like i just feel like i'm gonna put everything in the toddler room you know and it'll just be easier for the toddlers to like do what they got to do and keep their needs up so yeah maybe we'll kind of not do that for a little bit even though it's tempting because the toddlers are so cute <laughs> we'll try to just yeah wait a little wait a bit it's probably best so yeah um london is i don't know what he's doing he kind of does whatever he wants <laughs> he's just doing whatever he likes um but you guys i'm gonna have her finish up this painting and then she'll sell it and yeah i'm gonna wrap up this episode here so the next episode is a fun one i'm excited so i hope you guys enjoyed this one and i hope you guys are all having an amazing amazing day and don't forget to leave some positivity down below i love you guys all so so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys You gotta listen up, listen up There's not a thing that I can't get from you Boy, I don't need that much, need that much